Bismillahirrahmanirrahim and Assalamu alaikum. This is Cambridge Primary Mathematics Learners Book 3 for Grade 3 and I am Asya Hassan. In my last video I have done this page number 10. It is actually the first working page of this book. I hope this is very much clear to you to my regular viewers and if it is not you can watch the video again. Okay, here is a small puzzle given to you on this page. We will solve it today. And we will work on exploring numbers from 0 to 1000. The main purpose of this chapter is, in this chapter we will be dealing with uh, bigger numbers. We will tell our students to explore higher numbers from 0 to 1000 and uh, how to go backward and forward with these numbers. Okay, this part is actually taken from a grid that is 0 to 1000. It is actually a square grid. Okay, there is one very main thing to understand that there is difference between 0 to 1000 square grid and a vertical chart 1 to 1000 vertical chart please try to understand the difference between a square grid and vertical chart in square grid numbers would be given uh, to us like this 230 330 uh, counting from top to bottom will go in hundreds 230 330 and it will become 430 uh, this puzzle is actually taken from 0 to 1000 square grid please remember this word it is a square grid i'll show you square grid in my this video Okay, 230, 330, and 430. And from left to right. From left to right, it will go, uh, counting will go in tens. Like it will be 320 here, and it will be 340 at this hand side. Okay. Uh, now I'm going to show you what is 0 to 1000 square grid. This is actually 0 to 1000 square grid. I have prepared this grid for you before starting this video. And I have written the counting on the top for you to understand that it's both sides are equal. It is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 at this side. And 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10 at this side. So it is a square grid. If it is 230 here, it will go 330, 430. And from left to right, it will go in 10s. 320, 330, 340. We can see any other number like 680. If we will go backward, it will be 580 and forward, it will be 780. And from left to right, it is 670, 680 and 690. Now I am going to show you vertical chart, 1 to 1000 vertical chart. We usually use this one. We rarely use this one. Tell your students only when it is given in your chart that you have to go in countings uh, with hundreds from top to bottom. Only when it is given, then you have to use a square grid. Otherwise, we always use a vertical chart. We always use a vertical chart. Please remember this. We always use a vertical chart. Let me write it here for you to remember that we always use a vertical chart and we rarely use a square grid okay uh, how will we tell our students when to use a square grid only when it is given to you in paper 
or only when it is given to you in your book or workbook that you have to go from top to bottom in hundreds. See here the counting is going in hundreds. Then we will use a square grid. Otherwise we will always use a 1 to 1000 vertical chart. Let me show you a vertical chart now. This is a vertical chart. It goes from top to bottom and see the numbers written here on this chart are like see we have done uh, 1 to 1000 chart sorry 1 to 100 chart before it's same like this like when we are going from left to right we will keep on increasing one number when we will go from top to bottom we will increase in tens it will go in counting in tens so the same method will go on with this vertical chart this is uh, 1 to 100 and then see 91, 91, 101, 111. See, let me show you like I am unable to write on this book here. Let me copy it on paint to show you how will it work. take pen okay see 91 if we add 10 in it it will become 101 92 102 93 103 right it is connected actually it is connected they just have separated this chart by showing us that a next hundred is started and when we will go left to right left to right it will just increase in one number it will just increase in one number counting in ones and if we go from top to bottom it will increase in counting in tens see 113 123 okay so come back to this page it is a vertical chart and it will go till 1000 here 1000 is written like we can pick up any number and check if our chart is correct. We can use like if it is if it is 945 and if we go up it is 935 and on the bottom it is 955 from left side it is 944 that is only one number less than 945 and only one number greater than 945 is 946 okay so i have explained uh, number charts very well to you now we will do these puzzles over here they just have told us that uh, number three is in hundreds place number two is in tens place and number seven is in ones place now we will do this complete these pieces which are from one to one thousand number grid see they have not written that they are from uh, one to one thousand square grid right when it is a square grid then we are not using all the numbers see in this square grid see we haven't used uh, 151 152 153 because it is a square grid so when square grid is not mentioned we will always use a vertical chart here is the book let's copy this puzzle and solve it let's 
take green color this time okay so in a normal uh, 1 to 1000 vertical chart where 132 will go when we will go from top to bottom we will just increase numbers and tens it will be 132 142 152 and this way we will uh, write 153 154 and 155 155 when we will go from bottom to top we will write 145 and 135 tell your students that they can check their answers by doing this 132 133 and 134 two boxes in the middle no need to write it on the paper, but they can just check their answers in their mind. 142, 143, 144 and 145 is given here. Now we will do this one. 479, it will be 478 this way and 480 this way. And from top to bottom, we will go in counting in tens. It is 4, 68, 4, 58. And it will go 4, 88 and 4, 98. And this will go 4, 70. It will be 4, 60, 4, 90 and Four, sorry, 500 now. Okay. It is 147. Let's do uh, this grid. 147 backwards is 146 and 145. And downwards is 155. Because downwards is counting in tens. Let's check this one, 147, sorry, 147, Let's check it. See? It's 147 here. 145, 140, sorry, 146 and then 145 and downwards is 155. We took it from our vertical chart from 1 to 1000, 1 to 1000 and we have checked our answer. This one is for you. Do it by yourself. And if you need help, you can ask me in comment sections. Or if you can solve it, you can write your answers in the comment section. I'll check your answers and I'll give you remarks. Thanks for watching. And uh, inshallah, in our next video, we will be doing next page. So, okay, Allah Hafiz.